This media will give a clear understanding how a tunnel bow thruster works. A bow thruster is a transversal propulsion device built into or mounted to the bow of a ship to make it more maneuverable. It consists of thruster, hydraulic cabinet, gravity tank, centralized control device, control panel. This represent the schematic diagram of a bow thruster system. Power is transmitted from the prime mover or electric motor through a flexible coupling, input shaft, bevel gears to propeller shaft, rotating the propeller in constant direction. Prime mover is an electric motor which drives the propeller shaft. The propeller parts consist of four propeller blades a propeller hub with a hydraulic servo motor and the sliding block mechanism. The propeller blades are connected to blade carriers by blade bolts and this assures easy exchange of blades in the thruster tunnel. The gear case which carries propeller parts is connected to the thrust tube by bolts and this assures easy overhauling of all parts inside the tube. Pitch control for a thruster is very similar to that for a controllable pitch propeller. This tube has inner and outer pipe through which a head and a stern oil passes. The tube is ported at either end to allow oil flow and segregated by seals. Oil is transferred to the tube via ports on the shaft circumference over which is mounted the OT box. The oil passing through the OT tube result in reciprocal movement of the servo motor piston. Pressurized oil from the solenoid valve is fed to the hydraulic motors via an oil transfer tube in the propeller shaft. This movement of the piston is converted to rotary movement of the blades by the sliding block mechanism. The OT tube is rigidly attached to the piston as the piston moves fore and aft so, the entire length of the tube is moved in the same way. A feedback mechanism is attached to the tube. This also allows for checking of blade pitch position from within the bridge.